welcome um this is the um july readings i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um thank you for supporting my channel each and every person please like and share these videos the third quarters is out go check out the third quarters it's very important now this month of july is the month of uh, the wheel of fortune and this is going to be a wonderful wonderful month whatever that is coming up is going to be unbelievable um, it's going to be good um, the wheel of fortune is bringing fortune just for everyone so some new endeavor some new information could be coming out where there is going to be some new endeavor that is going to be transpiring and coming in for you guys so, so i want to say thank you for being here the week of readings are out the quarters are out go check it out the month of july is a fire energy a fire sign it's a lucky month but it is also the month of five weeks so we have the energy of five weeks that is in July. So let's go in and see what is coming up. So what we have is the energy of secrets. Secrets are going to be coming out about a whole lot of money. Whatever that was happening and transpiring. I see a whole lot of secrets is coming out about some money. Money that was stolen or taken. And people are finding out the truth about some deceptive play that has happened and has transpired. So I see some of you are going to be finding out something about money, money that was taken, money that someone has stolen from your company, your business or stolen from you. It's all going to be coming out and it's about a lot of money. OK, so um, this is going to be the energy that is going to be. Um, coming up uh, in the month of um, the first week of July then we see you're going to be overcoming some um, situation some of you are going to be moving forward some of you are overcoming finding out these secrets that you're going to be using to move forward so be aware um, of what is happening and transpiring in your world then we see balance is going to be coming in and when balance comes in it is dealing with uh, um, you balance out issues and situation where you found out things that was uh, plain um, secret things that was plain against you or against um, other people around you then I see truths are coming out in um, the four weeks a lot of truths is going to be coming out in the four weeks whatever that was transpiring um, truths people are going to be seeing the truth some people are just going to go in go within to find out what exactly was happening and transpiring so uh, this is also coming up and in the fifth week we see the energy of the devil whatever is transpiring the fifth week the energy of the devil comes in so you have to be aware um, and what is transpiring is that truths is going to be coming out about some deceptive play, some secrets contract that was created and some deceptive play that has transpired. People who have stolen money that was not of theirs. So the energy of the devil in the last week is a fire week. So be aware of this. OK, so um, this is a lot that is happening and is transpiring. Um, and so. When we look at the energy, we see you, you're coming in this month with a water sign energy where there is secrets, a water sign energy where there is secrets about things that is happening and transpiring. And I see truth is really going to be coming out because you have the energy of uh, justice. So justice is going to prevail in this month of July. It is uh, the wheel of fortune. So you have two energies where um karmatic justice is like a month of karmatic justice so the first week is a water energy and it is about some information that was kept from you that is going to be coming out um so we're seeing this energy that is coming up so what else is going to be coming up it is about your partner or about family members people um about your partner about family members um some secret or information is going to be coming out in the first week and i see you're going to be having a new start or they are going to be having a new start so this is wonderful and transparent because truth is coming out then i see balance um another sort of a balance where the angels is coming in to help some of you to push you along your way to push you in a new direction I see some of you are going to be balancing out issues with people in relationship and that sort of a thing. And that is coming up in the second week. 
the eye princess is going to also be in the second week so i see that your spirit guides and the eye princess is going to be coming in in order to help you to remove certain obstacles and blockage to let you be aware of certain information and certain things that has been transpiring that you were not aware of and i see this is going to be opening up doors of opportunities for you guys as we look at the energy of the third week and the center week, we see some of you are finding strength to deal with some issues and some situation. The third week is going to be affecting the Virgos and the Leos. The Virgos and the Leos are going to be affected in the third week. Okay, so whatever the issue, the situation is that was um, happening um, in the third week, the Virgos and the Leos are going to be affected. Then we see an end is coming to a situation with the Leos whatever is happening and transpiring and is going to be coming um, in for some situation with the Leo so so I see balance is going to be created because I see it could be the energy of a Virgo that is going to be um, have to find strength but I see ending is coming in for the Leo's a transition and secrets of the Leo's are coming out and a transition is coming in as we look at the fourth week, the fourth week, we have the Wheel of Fortune, which is the energy of the month. So you can really see that this is karmatic justice. Whatever is transpiring, I see the energy of the hangman where people are going within. And I see that some of you, the Wheel of Fortune is running and coming in in the four weeks, in the four weeks for some of you, um, where you're going to be seeing your way out and balance is going to come in. The fifth week, I see transition, whatever the situation is, I definitely see transition is coming up. Transition is going to be coming up for the Capricorns um, and the Sagittarius in the four weeks. So in the four weeks, Pisces, Capricorn and Sagittarius, you're going to be affected in the four weeks. So in the fifth week, we are seeing the energy of the Aries and um i see some success is going to be coming out with some deceptiveness that was going on people are going to be finding out the truth what has been happening and transpiring the deceptiveness that has played and the 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 people who have work to create some deceptiveness in um the worlds um of you guys and i see a success secrets is going to be coming out and this could be some sort of a release that is going to be coming up for some of you because the sun and the wheel of fortune is success and wherever the success is coming from is after you have gone through some deep pain okay a tower moment is coming down um and this tower moment is coming down because they're releasing the devil releasing the negative energy relief and releasing the obstacles releasing whatever that was blocking you guys so you're ending july being released from some obstacles some issues and situation that was happening and transpiring so be aware of this that um whoever that was bondage or people were lying and uh, creating um, obstacles and collaborating in in together the truth is going to be coming out and I see the energy of the devil the sun and uh, um, the the tower moment this is saying that whatever injustice that was played it's coming to an end okay so this is really really wonderful and there are certain um, cards in the deck that is just for general it's just for people it's just the general situation that is happening with people. Um, these are the major arcana that is going to be working in the month of July that is going to be helping each and every person. Each and every person is governed or a major, um, a major arcana. And um, you will know what is going to be coming up and what is going to be transpiring for you guys, okay? So um, I'm going to do a bowl to bowl to let people know where to look in which week, um, which weeks are going to be affecting you guys. So, so when we look at the first week, I see the Cancers and the Geminis and the Aquarians. Cancer, Geminis and Aquarians is going to be affected by the first week. Okay, Cancer, Geminis and Aquarian is going to be affected by the first week. As we look at the second week, we see the energy of the Leos and um, the Virgos 
the Leos, the Virgos, and the Pisces. The Leos, the Virgos, and the Pisces is going to be affected in the second week. In the third week, what we have is that we have the Aquarians, the Leos, and the Scorpions. Aquarians, Leos, and Scorpion is going to be affected in the third week. When we look at the fourth week, we have the energy of the Pisces and Scorpions. Then we have the um, some luck is going to be coming in for everyone in the fourth week. Um, the luck could be um, where karmatic situation is going to be healed with the Aquarian a tower moment um, for the Aquarian where issues is going to be released out of your life in um, the third the fourth week where I, I see that this wheel of fortune for you Aquarians is going to be breaking blockages in your life as we look at the Aries I see a, a connection is going to be ending for the Aries um, with this wheel of fortune so the wheel of fortune is is affecting um the aquarians and the aries then we see on top of that we have we are dealing with the pisces and the scorpion and their materialistic abundance so spices pisces and and scorpion and um, the wheel of fortune is bringing you materialistic abundance and this is going to be good also for the energies of the capricorn so the capricorns and uh, uh, are also going to be receiving financial stability in the fourth week because the wheel of fortune is bringing back something for the past uh, scorpions what i see is that you scorpions is going to be broken is um whoever that was uh, holding you as bondage you're going to be released from this negative energy or this negative person or this negative situation a tower moment is going to be um transition the sun is coming out for each and every person that is going to be affecting each and every person will be affected in by the energies in uh, the fifth week um because uh, whoever was bonded to some form of negative energies negative situation i see that this is going to be coming down an end is going to be coming in and what is going to be transpiring is that you are going to be released from whatever deceptiveness that was uh, affecting you in your life you're definitely going to be released from these deceptiveness so it is karmatic justice that is going to be coming up and is going to be transpiring with you guys however this is going to be forming a sort of um um a, um, a force of energy that is going to be creating a lot of issues and situation is going to be resolved okay so um let's go in and see so i see some positive news is going to be coming in um this positive news could be coming in and for um some cancers in um the first week um some of you could be receiving some positive news i see false sight with you cancers if you cancers and gemini's are in a relationship i see some false um false situation between you and your partner so whoever is married also you're going to be finding out some false situations some secrets about your partner whether you're a cancer or a gemini or whoever is married then i see older people i see people 50 or 60 years and older you're going to be receiving a new start whatever is transpiring some of you could be thinking about to um remarry okay so women um, or, or older people six years and older could be thinking about remarried and some of you are going to be relocating or having a new start then we see celebration is coming up and this is going to be good because I see a lot of you are happy that things um, the, the shutdown could be opening up in the first week a lot of you are happy a lot of celebration people are going out eating connecting with each other so this is going to be good so as we look at the sec the first week going in the second week we see um a friend is going to be coming in some of you could be receiving a really positive message from a friend coming in um the end of the first week going in the second week so um some positive news is going to be coming in from a friend and that is good then i see some of you are going to be finding out that if you're married that a child is not for you okay so some dna tests or some 
um, information is going to be coming up that someone has used a child or took a child that was not for them some information about a child is going to be coming up some deceptiveness with a child that has transpired is going to be also coming up and this is um is as if some of you were married to someone and all of a sudden a child end up at the door saying that they are um a child to and some dna test is going to be showing um whatever is transpiring it's about some falseness with a relationship and a marriage some of you could have been married and a baby is born and the dna does not match the father's or um so that is coming up then i see some imprisonment that is going to be coming up for a lady 60 years and older whoever this lady is and whatever this lady has done i see justice came up on this lady and some imprisonment is going to be coming up for this lady this lady is um a very old person um whatever is transpiring i see some imprisonment is coming up for this lady um uh, some secrets that this lady had okay so older people I see a TEF, a TEF that has transpired. And be careful, ladies and gentlemen, the end of the first week going into the second week, some of you, a TEF, um, a TEF of a old lady, this lady is 50 years and older, whoever this lady is, has created some TEF. It could be coming up as an Aquarian woman. Um, this is the energy of the Aquarian. Whatever is transpiring, I see a TEF, so someone could be breaking in your parents' house, um, in this uh, the first week going in the second week so be aware secrets is going to be coming out then we see the energy yes someone is yeah a breaking is going to be happening in a house okay and it is going to be happening um in the second week the second week a breaking is going to be happening in a house whoever does this break in i see they're going to be finding out exactly who this person is so I see some of you older ladies as wish that you had never done something. It's going to be affecting the Cancers and the Aquarians. Um, so you Cancers and Aquarian older lady um, wish you hadn't done something. Some of you Aquarian ladies or Cancer ladies could be seeing some jail time. I see a transition is going to be coming up because of some deceptive play that has transpired. A whole lot of you are in thoughts, the Leos and... Uh, the Leos and the Virgos are in thoughts. Leos, Virgos, and Aquarians are in thoughts and thoughts in the second week going in the third week. You're in a lot of thoughts, whatever is transpiring. You're thinking about a child and some false situation that has happened to a child. I told you there is a whole lot of situation that is coming up with kids um, that is transpiring and a whole lot of information is coming out um with situation to have to do with kids but i see um and um some of you a friend is going to be helping you with a situation with a kid so however that is transpiring and you're um and it, it has to do with leos and the aquarian some situation with a kid as uh, some of you could be, um if you're a leo you could be getting pregnant for also an aquarian okay now i see some of you are waiting 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 the third week going into fourth week you're waiting for some information some news so i see you're really really waiting um to hear of some information and some news then i see some desperation for the leos whatever is transpiring there is some karmatic issue that is coming back for the leos and the scorpion and pisces so be aware of this so, so leo scorpion and pisces i see some desperation um, that is um, the wheel of fortune is bringing something back to you so that you can heal this situation I see you ladies um, 50 years and older I see you are uh, rethinking and reconsidering some decision you made in the past whatever the decision that you have made in the past I see you're thinking and reconsidering this decision that you have made in the past so I see some of you your enemy is going to be down some of you have a male enemy this enemy is going to be down this enemy is someone who works in a government institute a corporation or a bank um 
um, institution, whoever this person is and whatever this person has done, I see a tower moment is coming down for this person because they have seen the deceptive play that this person has done. So some of you could be at your workplace that you were dealing with an enemy. This person is a very deceptive person. This person is a male and this person was blocking you and your financial stability. Then I see a lot of money is going to be returned because some of you were blocked. You Capricorns were blocked and a lot of money is going to be returned because they found out that um, people have stolen from you and your business. And uh, um, this money is going to be returned to you because the tower moment is coming to return it. I see a situation with the lovers, especially you men. Um, whatever is transpiring, I see a tower moment is coming down on you men. Um, so you men that play the love game, I see a tower moment is coming down on you men that play the love game. Men that go with women only for money and um, extort women only for money, a tower moment is coming down on you. Again, um, there is also a tower moment that is going to be coming down on your female enemy the truth is going to be coming out that this person has stolen a lot from you okay so whatever is transpiring um they're going to be seeing the truth about this female enemy that has, has stolen a lot from you guys and um it is an aries person and the truth is going to be coming out a tower moment is coming down on a Aries and a Scorpion or, or a Aries and a Pisces, a towel moment is going to be coming down because they saw the deceptiveness, what this Aries and the Pisces has played. And they realize and find out some deceptiveness of a, a Pisces and an Aries. And I see a towel moment is coming down. So at the end of the month, the, the fourth week going in the fifth week, um, some of you were dealing with a Pisces um a pisces and an aries and i see a tower moment coming down for these people whoever these people are especially this aries and if there's a young person is from another culture another race another culture of another race this person is very deceptive and they are seeing the truth of this person um the what they have done and i see this is coming down a government institute a corporation is seeing the lies and deceptiveness and is seeing your enemy your enemy is in some desperation desperation in the last week because the truth is coming out about what this person has done in order to create and uh, create wealth for themselves by um if you're dealing with um um if you're dealing with uh, identity theft people are seeing the truth about a young fire sign person and uh, um, some advisor and a young fire sign person what they have done i see truth is coming out a government institution is seeing the truth i see a tunnel moment is coming down on a lawyer or an advisor um the end of the month of august and i see um unexpected surprises is going to be coming in for some of you we're dealing with uh, a false deceptiveness where your child was involved in some this um in some issues and some of you are going to be finding out that your partner or your lover was aware of um what was happening with your child and never say anything and i see truths are going to be coming out because a tower moment is going to be coming down and they're going to be finding out exactly um who um exactly who um was connected in this bold play so i see sadness for some of you later six years and older whatever is transpiring there is a whole lot of sadness uh, for you ladies 60 years and older so be aware of um whatever is transpiring so as we look at the month i see some of you um coming in with some uh, sweet messages from a friend but be careful because there's some faults that is plain. A lot of you are going to be realizing that. Uh, um, um, and some of you, your parents or your grandparents is going to be finding out that the child is not yours. So it could be a grandparents came and look at the baby and is going to be realizing that the baby is not yours. <laughs> you know, we have. Um, or mothers and grandparents, they come in, one look at the baby, mm -mm, baby has nothing um, that look like us, okay, so be aware of this. Then I see some cel celebration because you're going to be finding out that some deceptive play of someone who had broken in your house 
um the truth is coming out now and people are seeing the truth i see some of you will be worried okay um people are seeing the truth about what has transpired if your house was broken in they're going to be finding in the person definitely um celebration is going on but be careful because i see some falseness with a false lover um who could be entering your house and this is what i was giving a lot of you a message about um people coming to your house and they're asking for your wi -fi. don't do it because this is a situation where someone is going to be coming to someone else asking for a wi -fi. it's affecting older people who also live alone that people is coming in i see this older woman 60 years and older it's so sudden because um someone came in asking for some help and uh, um, asked to get on her Wi-Fi and I see that this uh, this old thing has transpired so you older ladies be aware um, of what is happening and transpiring because I see you older ladies um, are saddened because this um, this man came in with some um, you know some sweet talk or whatever and it transpired so be aware um, so a lot is going on um this month is like a whole lot of stuff is going on but um the most important thing where the tower moments are is um things ending abruptly especially um um for the pisces and scorpions your tower moment is coming up in the fourth week where um your um your enemy is going to be removed okay your enemy is going to be removed some of you are going to be realizing that your biggest enemy was your partner or a lover that you were seeing they knew what was happening to your child and was connected to the same organization institution and i see an investigation is going to be taking place that they knew i see a whole lot of information is going to be coming out about an adv advisor or a lawyer or that sort of a people adversary which is accountant and that sort of people a whole lot of information is going to be coming in i see a tower moment coming down for a young um aries person whoever this young aries person is in the last week a huge tower moment because they're going to be finding out that a aries person use an adviser um to fraud and falsify some information okay so this is coming up. So there is a lot of sadness is coming up for Aquarians and the Pisces. A lot of sadness, legal issues with Aquarius and Pisces. They're going to be finding out some false things uh, and a lot of sadness that is coming up. So let's look at the Cancers. I see truths is going to be coming out about some secrets, some false uh, friends around you Cancers. Truths are going to be coming out about some secrets, some secrets that was kept i see a whole lot of truths is coming out about some of you um who are in a relationship so, um truths are going to be coming out because people are going to be finding out the truth okay whatever is happening people are going to be finding out the truth in the first week then i see changes is going to be happening for cancers and gemini in the first week because of some false situations some of you cancers could be going to jail um, the energy of the cancers could be going to jail. I see a whole person is also saddened because of something that they have doing, done in the past. Justice came up. So um, I see changes. Um, some of you cancers could be going to jail. Some of you cancers, uh, um, you, some of you Geminis, your partner could be going to jail for some um, um, connecting with some false corporation institution. Then I see the energy of people 30 years and older. I see some of you uh, people 30 years and older who had um, stolen it something from an older woman 60 years and older you are going to be caught as some sadness for people um between the age of 18 and 35 in the first week as we look at the second week i see an end and a destructive end is coming in um and um secrets are coming out this is the eye princess whatever is transpiring the eye princess a lot of secrets is coming out about a deceptive corporation and a criminal corporation and what was going on and the network of people information is going to be coming in um for you of uh, virgos that you have to find balance so you virgos some information is going to be coming in where you virgos have to find inner strength and balance to deal with whatever is happening and, and transpiring then we see the energy of um 
a transition is coming up some of you are going to be changing um work career changes um new start career changes some of you are going to be finding yourself pregnant or if you're pregnant you have to go to the hospital because of some medical issue that is going to be um coming up okay then we see the energy of the aquarians i see a block is going to be placed on the aquarians whatever is transpiring i see some of you aquarians are going to be blocked um go check out your own personalized reading to know why you're going to be blocked um but i see an aquarian is going to be blocked you're waiting on some message but i see some blockages has come up for you aquarians ends are coming in for the leos and all the leos is desperate and ending is coming in for the leos whatever that was happening and transpiring a whole lot of endings is going to be coming in for the leos okay then i see a situation with a government institution there was some um false play with it within um a government institute see um and i see um whether it's in your company or a government institute or corporation i see they're going to be ending it and taking down your enemy then i see for you capricorns whatever that was stolen is going to be returning whatever the situation that was transpired whatever that was stolen is going to be returning to you capricorns i see some of you um a lover or a partner has stolen a whole lot of stuff and i see um money is going to be returning to you capricorns um i see really a new start is coming up for um a lot of people a lot of people are going to have a new start being released from some lies deceptiveness that had played a whole lot of people are going to be coming up um receiving a new start in the fourth week okay some deceptiveness a whole lot of people are going to be having this new start in the first week then i see the energy of karmatic issues coming back for scorpion and um pisces scorpion and pisces i see a whole lot of you were dealing with some karmatic issues and a tower moment is coming down to release you from these karmatic issues with these people and situation that was transpiring then i see jealousy whoever this person was was someone from another race or cultural creed was very jealous and deceptive and i see a government institute organization have seen the lies because this is the um um in the last week with this aries person whoever this aries person is i see a young person an old person i see a legal issues and uh, justice and they're going to be taking down you especially the young um they realize that um the young Aries lied about their papers and information and a government institution saw the deceptiveness of an ex-co-workers. This person is um, an Aries, an ex-co-workers for some of you that is an Aries and they found out the secrets. Secrets are coming out where um, advisors that work um, for government institutes and organization um, they are going to be finding out that these people have been selling documentation and creating a lot. They had secret um, contracts that they made for people and truths are coming out because um, truths are coming out about government. Um, so it has to do with passport and that sort of a thing, how certain people made secrets, uh, um, contracts and um, was buying and selling passport and I see all of this because they were selling other people information um, and all of this is coming out I see luck so a lot of you end up with luck especially to, for the people congratulations for all the people who had uh, um, their identity was stolen I see that uh, um, you're going to be receiving positive message from the, the governments um to re resolve this situation because the last week of july is when governments is going to be start um to invest the, uh, they, they have been investigating but the information is going to be coming out that they are have seen um where people uh, was using other people information in order to acquire position in countries and they're going to be seeing that people information was copied and all these people who were advisors immigration lawyers and that sort of a thing is going to be um if you have been doing uh, things illegal it's all going to be coming out in the last week because i see that they have been investigating you guys so so 
wow I, I i would really really love to just go deeper in this for you guys because there is just so much and this is why i said always listen um to the general reading but i'm going to um make a picture of this so that you guys can have it um it takes longer when i make the photo the pictures of this uh it takes longer but yet still it is good for you people to understand what is coming out what is transpiring i really do love you guys um you know um whatever is transpiring and is happening for you guys it is about a shift of changes that is coming up on this planet and especially a whole lot of shift and changes is coming up in government institution um definitely a whole lot of shifts and changes is coming up with government institution or organization and i see they're finding out a whole lot of corruption a whole lot of corruption and especially um the fourth week going in the fifth week as especially when you end this month you're ending this month with a tower moment releasing you from some fault um contracts that was made for some of you or some deceptive move especially for people who had identity theft and that sort of a thing i see a resolution is going to be coming in it's as if they're setting up a new sort of um um a new division in order to find out these things young aries who have falsified documentation um you are going to be caught so you can't run they already know you you can't run they know you they know what you have done they have been seeing this so um sad news for and it it, it, it is doesn't have to be aries it's coming up as aries but it could be other people also so i see the energy um that is coming up here is that the man with a coin I see a lot of you are going to be focusing on building your own financial stability. You are going to be balancing your masculine and feminine energy in order to build a stability, a financial stability in your world. Okay. So whatever that was happening and was transpiring, um, a whole lot of you are going to be really, really focusing um, on building your financial stability around you. This is a month where the man with a coin, the wheel of fortune is going to bring back stability in your world. So I got to say to you guys, thank you. Um, please like and share this video. Go and check out your own personalized energy now. Um, um, I'm going to try and see if I can use this format um, for you guys. But this is just a general. So in the other reading, it's just everything is going to be coming out for you guys. So you know who you're dealing with. I do love you guys. Please like and share. And I hope if this was your first time, please return, subscribe to the channel and become a member because the member, a lot of my members are growing so much. Um, and I um, um, what is transpiring, especially with the new changes in YouTube, is that as you become a member, you get so many extra information and it all break down because in one reading, you can't have all the information of what is to be expected. I do love you guys. I will speak to you next time.